Hi everybody, so one of the questions I regularly get about my Shadow Boost Cloud Gaming PC is what games can you play on it? Because often people are coming from uh, game streaming services like uh, GeForce Now or Google Stadia um, and they have a restricted selection of games. Um, I mean with GeForce Now, admittedly there's hundreds and hundreds of games on there but you can't just play anything. Well. The answer with Shadow is you can play anything, okay? So your Shadow gaming PC, your Shadow Boost gaming PC, or whichever whichever um, one you go for, is a Windows 10 gaming PC in the cloud. Quite simply, that this is this is the desktop of my um, gaming gaming Shadow gaming PC. Um, it's got a GTX 1080. Um, graphics card it's got 12 gigabytes of ram it's got a 256 gigabyte ssd i've added another add, i've added another 256 gigabytes of hard drive space to it you pay for all this you know um but that then means you know you can you know you install steam and any games you buy on steam you can play you install the epic launcher you can get all the free games that epic like uh, to give away you can install blizzard.net so you can be playing warzone or call of duty you know you can one of the big problems with the likes of geforce now is games like escape from tarkov um you couldn't play because they they weren't authorized but you can install the battlestate games launcher and play escape from tarkov um you know you can you can buy keys, Steam keys, from the likes of cdkeys.com and, and 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 play them. You can. Uh, I don't know if Bethesda. Do Bethesda have a launcher? They must do. But you can, you know, play um, games of that. You could install. I guess um, you you could have Windows. Um, you could have Xbox Game Pass for PC, and you could download those games. Um, you could there's Bethesda again, isn't there? There's Bethesda again. Um, good old games. You know, you can buy games off off GOG, um, Green Man Gaming. You can buy and install games off them. Um, so so you know, kind of don't worry about that sort of thing. The only thing you you can be limited by, all right, is if certain servers on certain games. Sometimes they don't let you use a VPN, okay? Um, uh, so what I found is sometimes on certain servers for games like DayZ and Rust, and it's only certain private servers, it's none of the public ones, it's all private servers, they can have a setting where they can say, actually, don't let anybody come and play who, who is coming for a VPN. And sometimes what they see is when they see um, a shadow gaming PC try to con connect, that's what they see now that is very very rare i've only come across it once or twice but that's the only only problem I, i've had everything else you're only limited by a hard drive space but one of the fantastic things about uh, having a shadow boost gaming pc is you are using their internet connection to connect to the internet you know it'd be a hundred gigabyte you know um really really fast internet connection so when you want to download a new game it's really fast so even though you may only have say even if you only had the 256 gigabyte base but i'd recommend you pay another three quid a month and get another 256 gigabyte even if you've only got 512 gigabytes worth of storage which honestly is pretty small you can delete a game and download another one in 20 minutes you know if it's a big game if it's a small game it'd be downloaded in no time at all so to answer the question once again what PC games can you play on your Shadow Boost? Any that you could play on a normal desktop or laptop. It is a Windows 10 gaming PC in the cloud. Quite simple as that. And the only problem with them at the moment is is the wait list. <laughs> if you want one. It works out at about £18 a month, I think. Um, if you get like uh, the Shadow Boost... Uh, version with some extra storage some, something like that but you've got to wait a few months before you can get it because they've got they've got this queue at the moment but there we go hopefully that helps hopefully that um, answers some questions if you've got any more stick them in the question box below the video and uh, i'll try and answer them if you enjoy the video hit like if you want to see more of the same press subscribe and i will of course see you again soon